Would you like to enhance your trading strategy with Quick Launch Microlearning? Well, you're in the right place. My name is Emma and I'm part of the Seven Taps team. Allow me to quickly show you around. But first, let's briefly chat about why you need to be using Seven Taps. The most obvious reason is that it saves you time. You can create and deliver courses in just 15 minutes. Secondly, we provide the smoothest learner experience ever. There are no downloads, no logins, and no apps for your user. Content is accessible on any device. Thirdly, 7Tap's science-based framework is perfectly tailored to ensure maximum effectiveness and engagement with the microlearning content you create. Last but not least, we complement your existing LMS, making it easier to reinforce knowledge and encourage behavior change. Want to know more about how teams like your own are using 7Taps? be sure to check out the use case page on our website. Now, let's start with your quickest ways to create mini courses. The first one is using the 7Taps Transformer. You simply select a file from your device or paste a link here, and within seconds, you get a microlearning asset from that material. This works really well for training reinforcement or content curation. The second way is to draft a mini course with the help of our AI microlearning builder. Use it as a brainstorming partner and generate microlearning drafts in 30 seconds. This draft is fully editable. You can delete anything unnecessary and you can add any content to make sure it's tailored to your learner's needs. Now, the third way to build a mini course is to start from scratch. Let's review this process. We've carefully selected particular cards to help you create optimal, straight to the point microlearning experiences. Let's start with the title card. Give your mini course a name and add a logo then a text card. Spice it up with a visual from the 7Taps library or by uploading your own image. I'm going to use a funny GIF here and I'll do the same for a couple more cards. Now, let's look at the video card. In 7Taps, you can upload your own video or you can magically convert text into video. So I'll paste the script and I'll choose an avatar to read out my text. Okay, now quiz time. I'm going to use multiple correct answer quiz here. With this comment, you can give immediate feedback to your learners to reinforce a key message you want people to remember. To ask an open-ended question, use a form card, and the poll card is available too. With this, you can list four options and see which is most popular among users. At the end of every mini course, I recommend that you include some actionable component. Encourage people to go and do something or practice that little skill. Or just like I did, you can drive learners to other resources to continue a learning experience. Okay, now for sharing. Once you're ready to share your mini course, click on the share button, enable sharing, and choose your preferred method. It might be sharing via a quick link, which you can paste anywhere. It could be with a QR code that you can print out and stick somewhere that'll be most useful to your learner in need. You can also share via email, text message, or WhatsApp. And of course, you can share Slack or Microsoft Teams. Another thing you can do is share a folder of courses instead of each one individually. Just put them in the folder and share it with your learners as a microlearning library. The final way you can share multiple courses is by creating a drip learning campaign that's called a learning path in 7Taps. How it works. Choose your course, set a schedule, add users to the learning path, then your content will automatically deliver according to your schedule. It's perfect for continuous training, training reinforcement, sales enablement, and new hire onboarding. And lastly, let me show you where you can monitor course performance and review user responses. First, go back to the home screen and then click on the statistics tab. Seven tab statistics contains three tabs. The highlight tab where you get essential data on your user performance. The users tab displays stats for individuals you can see how each of your users interacted with a course. And here, the performance tab, you'll find the responses to your quizzes, polls, and forms. So that was a very quick overview of what we built over here. If you wanna go deeper, I highly encourage you book a call with us. We can tell you how to create branching scenarios, how to enable single sign-on, and how 7Taps can be integrated with your HR system and many other tips. And in case any questions come up, ping us via the help button. Now get out there and start creating mini courses. Happy seven tapping.